Good morning, everybody. Here we go. Day is 499. <laughs> 499. Ice bass in a row. 41 degree air, no wind for a change. That's nice. 43 degree water. Thursday, May 9th. What a beautiful day. Sunny, blue sky. No wind. It was really windy the other day. It's been windy for about a week. Pillows flying all over back here. Leaves all over the place. I guess I shouldn't complain too much. I have a friend, Sarah, who lives in Tennessee, and they're dealing with tornadoes right now. So I guess I shouldn't complain about the wind. I'm just happy that there's no wind right now. I hope you're doing good, Sarah. I'm staying out of that tornado stuff. It's scary. But 499 ice bass in a row today, guys. Can you believe that? One more. That's tomorrow. We'll be 500. Almost a year and a half of not missing a day. It's just crazy. I just love this process. I love how far I've come. That's why I'm continuing to do it. But, uh, you know, no back pain, feeling better. I feel physically better. Just amazing. I love how these things make me feel. So I hope you do something that pushes yourself, that makes you feel good. Not only physically, but mentally gives you confidence. And I always talk about Jim Rohn's apple a day, like start with something small and do it every day, right? Where else would you start? <laughs> start with something very simple. Well, I just saw an interview with Joe Rogan talking to Jordan Peterson, who was talking about that, like set the bar low enough. And what he meant by that was, if there are things you could do that would help your life that are very simple little things, a lot of people just don't do them. They, they neglect to do them because that's eh, not big enough. It's not a big enough change. It won't have a big enough impact, so I'm not going to do it. But that's his point. That's where you start. That's exactly what Jim Rohn was talking about. Like, Start with something small that you can easily do. But it, if you did it, it would have a positive impact on your life. So I want you to think that through today. Think that through. Write in your journal, what are some very small, simple little things you could do that are not that difficult, but they would help you if you kept them up? And then guess what? That can add other things onto it. And then that grows into more things. This is all a process, guys. It's like everything is a journey and a process. Sometimes people don't do things because they don't see the immediate results and they forget this is a journey. <laughs> Not a pro this is a process. This is not like a destination. You get it right now. And we're conditioned, unfortunately, in our modern society to want and demand massive things or changes right now. That's not how the world really works. So think of something small you could do. I'd love to hear it. I'd love to hear some ideas for tomorrow, my 500th day in a row. The sun is coming up right now. <laughs> right in my face. Like literally right now. It's perfect timing. It's like I can watch it come up. So... Uh, a beautiful day. I'm not complaining about the sun, I'll tell you that. I love the sun. Beautiful day, no wind, blue sky, 499 in a row, guys. Give me some ideas on what you're going to start doing that's very small, that's going to help your life. And give me some ideas if you have any for what I could do to celebrate 500 days in a row doing an ice bath tomorrow. It's going to be fun. I'm going to do a hot springs tomorrow too, so I'm going to do both. I'll do a cold plunge first, and then a little later I'll do a hot springs. So that'll be fun. I'll get you a little video on that too. All right, guys, have a great day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care. All right. Woo. Let's do it.